welcome to another video and if only you knew what has happened since this yesterday's session i dropped the stupid phone had to fix the the screen got fucked up and I had to get it fixed and while at it i thought i should upgrade the storage unit the uh, mini sd that i have to a bigger one so i can you know be able to process videos at better quality because the last couple of grip videos haven't been at, uh, of best quality because they're just huge when they're being extracted. Um, it, it has taken me a couple of hours to be able to transfer all the fucking files from one uh, mini SD to the other, and I'm still not done, and the video is late to go up, so I left that stuff alone, and I'm just doing the voiceover because this is bullshit. Anyway, this is the first time with training with Costas Corcogelos at his gym called Train with Corco, that's an abbreviation of his last name. Uh, Costas is, um, He's a strong kid. He's a kid because he's 29. He's a very young man. He's very powerful. Uh, he's a strength coach. He's got his clients in there going on. He's got his, uh, his business going on. We're happy for him. He's a good dude. Uh, solid guy. I've been talking to him on social media since, I want to say, 21 or 22. And we've met a couple of times at the Dromada uh, Strength Challenge uh, contest and stuff. Contests. It's just it's been a few. So we got acquainted and we eventually kind of became, I guess, friends. We're not bros, but, you know, we're we're getting there. We're getting there. So that's the first time we're training with, in his gym with my boy, Manos, whom you've seen in, I'm guessing, several videos by now. Me and Manos are preparing for the Tromaras Strength Challenge 4, if I'm not mistaken. That's the fourth one. And uh, he's going to be competing uh, single ply. He's doing equipped lifting. Primarily, he's an equipped lifter. He's done. A, he's got. He has had a pretty big total uh, multiply, and uh, he's just. I mean, he's a strong dude overall. So, so we are going up to. That's a hundred. I cannot remember the exact numbers, but I'm gonna try and do my best. So that's a hundred and one kg specifically, because the the bigger plates, the inside plates, are a little bit heavier. Um, and uh, we're just warming up. He went up to, as you're gonna see, the next set, 110 kg, uh, and that's his last, like a raw single. I'm, I'm, I train raw and I compete raw. Uh, I did do a few um, bench band or slingshot, whatever the fuck you want to call it, in the end. Uh, some volume training, some I guess heavy, not too much volume, but it was heavy sets of triples, and I just annihilated my shoulders and my arms, which is fucking done. And uh, I actually literally couldn't find his um, video. I, I lost the original videos maybe uh, during the transfer. It's, it's been a, this, my day has been bullshit. So I, I managed to find the, so what is that? That's 150 kg, I think. I cannot even remember what this is. No, that certainly is not 150 kg. I think that was a 125 yeah that was 125 kg or 275 pounds something like that 265 any and um this is 140 kg for his uh he's trying to break in the shirt the shirt is pretty new from what i've gathered so i, I don't know if you guys lift equipped or anything i'm not an expert but i've trained with a lot of people who have and it's a bitch i mean it takes time to break the suits in you know you gain a little weight you're screwed you lose too much weight you're screwed it just doesn't come down so you know that's three plates for me. That should be 308, 310 pounds. Uh, I was hoping to get a PR, and I did, as you will uh, eventually see. Here he's got, I think that's 162.5, if I remember well, or 163.5 kg, which is just above three, it's close, it has to be close to 360, something like that. I think 352 is 160 kilograms, so that should be 357, 58. You know, I'm not, I'm not a fucking calculator, but I'm doing the best I can. Uh, went well, of course the press is good, but it, it's, it cannot touch. This shirt, you will see very soon. It just, it needs a lot of weight to touch. Uh, that's my 150 kg, or 330, right? Yeah, okay, that's 330. Uh, nice little pause at the bottom. Not a huge pause, but, you know, I was shooting for the bigger number, so, you know, I don't think it would have been immaculate. I don't think I could. That is, what is this now? I think that's his last set. Uh, with 185 kilograms, I think, 185, 186, that's why Costas is there, uh, kind of, because cause we tried to side spot him and stuff, it's just so uneven, you know, one, one guy might be pulling a little harder, and when you're truly max, when it's your true max, you just can't, 
Uh, for the record, I barely touched the fucking bar. I didn't hold anything. I probably I told him I took probably like a kilogram. I just balanced it more so because I didn't want to land on his face. My PR is coming uh, very soon. What is this now? That's 160 kg. So that that is 352. A uh, close grip, right? I cannot hold it super close because I've I'm fat i guess i don't know my, my back is wider than it used to be when i was like 240 to 45 fucking eight nine years ago so i have had to bring my arms my my grip just a little bit uh, further out I, it's literally like a thumb out just a thumb's length out i cannot hold it super wide because the stress goes too much in my elbows and i cannot tuck my arms in that much to meet to have like a straight line between my wrist and my elbow so if it's not straight to me to just you know change it a little bit and do it better uh, here I'm doing a triple with the um, Monster Power, the blue band, that is uh, 160 kg again, and I think I went up to 170 kg, and I held it, I think that's a little closer, I can't remember now. I lost the Manus, uh, Manus' uh, 150 kg with a, with his uh, slingshot, and I, I'm a, you know, I'm an idiot, but I try my best to retrieve all that shit, and I couldn't. I was lucky that I found this video that I actually found on Instagram, and I used my screen recorder just to show you what the fuck I went through for this video. Anyway, I'm glad I'm able to do the voiceover. I will, we want to thank Costas. It was a good experience, good dude, and uh, we will definitely be doing it again. Thank you for watching.